Hello and welcome to the video. This is a quick little video to explain what solid state lithium batteries are. Uh, this isn't a solid state battery, this is a standard GMB one. This is a 7500 milliamp hour 6S pack that I use in some of the planes, but I just needed a prop. However, I was up at 3DXR talking to Ben about this and they're starting to use these solid state lithium packs in some of their big professional UAVs that they manufacture and sell. And I've not really come across them from the hobby side because it's a kind of a new version of the lithium battery where they basically replace the kind of liquid or gel style electrolyte with solid electrolyte in as well. And they're kind of a hybrid between lithium ion packs and lipo packs like this. But let me hand over to Ben and he can kind of talk a little bit more about what solid state is and why they use it and why, hopefully, in time, we'll get our hands on it in hobby sized batteries too. So today I'd just like to show you a new range of batteries. So you may recognize the tattoo batteries that we've got in here. These are a good sort of long standing, really reliable battery. And today the battery in the middle here, um, this is from one of our suppliers T drones. And this particular model is a 22 amp hour 6S. And what we have here is the sort of latest um, and highest energy density of battery. So we're over 300 watt hours per kilogram. These are readily available and in very high um, high quality. The batteries we've got out, out here today is just give you a bit of a visual idea as to what the higher energy density means. So if you can see here, we have the same voltage and capacity battery. So this is also a 6S22. This is a traditional LiPo. And the new battery is also a 6S22, but there's some significant differences. It's physically smaller, the weight, just under two and a half kilos, so 2.46. This one is under two kilos, this is 1800 grams. So there's a 660 gram difference between these two batteries here. And if we were to compare it to a battery of a similar physical size, we would have the 16 amp hour or 16,000 milliamp hour here. Um, but we still have a weight saving against this lower capacity battery. So we're still about 160 grams lighter, or 180 grams lighter than the traditional battery here. So these new higher energy density batteries are giving you a smaller and lighter battery for the same capacity. But there is some downsides. Um, well, there are only downsides on your application. The main difference between them is the C rating. Now these I generally view as a sort of five to 10 C battery, whereas the Genze's Tattoo, um, these are a very high C rating battery for the size. Now, some of you looking at the sort of smaller FPV drones will see C ratings, 100C, something like that, that you, you don't get that in big batteries. So it, these are a 30C rating. Now in a large battery, that is, that is a very high C rating. You're talking about the ability to discharge this battery in two or three minutes. Um, that is it's a huge amount of power. I wouldn't recommend doing that. Uh, you will definitely degrade the battery's life, but the power is there for those uh, voltage spikes and uh, those, those power surges. So the main thing you've got to think, is this battery suitable for your application? Getting this higher capacity is also due to the battery chemistry. So these are a lithium ion um, solid state battery. These ones you can discharge much lower. You know, you're heading towards the three volts per cell to realize this capacity. And also um, what this low C rating means, you will get this capacity when it's discharged slowly. So you're talking about you know, I would only put this on something that's flying for over an hour. And um, if you were to drain this at its maximum C rating, you would find you would probably achieve slightly lower than the capacity. If you, we, we've tested these on um, a very slow discharge, a 2C discharge, and we actually get a high capacity than what's stated, which is a pleasant surprise. So yeah, we have this new range of um, high energy density solid state batteries. So over 300 watt hours per kilogram. So some of them, um, depending on the capacity and how the package are 330 watt hours per kilogram and um, these are available in this this is the smallest version it's a 22 amp hour we have a 27 amp hour a 30 and a 36 amp hour battery um, and these are all available now in stock on the website Thank you for watching my video. Check out the playlist and adding Painless360 to your search terms will help you find my content. If you haven't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button. It helps a lot. You can support the time I spend here answering questions and helping others by using the links in the video description.